What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, Boogie2988, coming at you live once again through the power of the internet. And today I got a special little surprise for you. This is my good friend Michael, a kid behind a camera here on YouTube. Y'all also may know him from the Angry Grandpa Show, which is how we got to know each other. Jeez, how long has that been, Michael? How long have we known each other? Four uh, I think or five? 2011. 2000 when? 2011, think, right? Uh, but yeah. A lot of people don't know this, but uh, my original Francis videos, those were all ad-libbed from nowhere. Uh, but the very first Francis Rage, the Mountain Dew Rage that went just completely nuts, was heavily inspired by your your dad, your angry grandpa, uh, with the uh, Pecan Pinwheels video. That went viral, and so we kind of uh, sculpted our thing to be a parody of that. And the first time we uploaded that, we went long form like you went. Um, and it did not did not perform, but we sh shaved it down and upload re-uploaded it like half a year later. Boom, viral, just boom, exploded. Uh, so I, I really love. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. You're welcome. Uh, anything you want to say to people before we get into the the thick of things? Just what's going on, you guys? Keep me on the camera here. I do I do a good impression. Here you go. What's up? Hey, what's up, you guys? Keep behind the camera. I do I do. I'll grab my webcam and I'll do that. On, on Twitch all the time. Don't get mad at me yet, because I know you're a little perturbed with me today. How was your Thanksgiving? Uh, it was good. You know, my dad finally came to my house for the first time, so mm -hmm. that was good. Finally. So it was a good Thanksgiving. What about you? I have yet to get to watch that video, but I'm excited about it. I We did really well. We had our friends over. We had a lot of fun. Um, my friends were all asking questions about Jesse and the stay there, because they saw the videos. And I didn't want to answer any questions. A couple of people that RSVP'd canceled out after seeing those videos. That upset me a little bit. Uh, but here's a secret that we have that we're ready to talk about today. And that's the secret behind the videos that ended up on McJuggernuggets over there with me. And the secret behind the stay. Michael, do you want to let the cat out of the bag? <laughs> it's just a prank, bro. It was just a prank, Jesse. Someone prank, send, send this video to Jesse. Make sure he sees it. This is a prank. And uh, just to be very clear, whose idea was all of this, by the way? Whose idea was this? Because it wasn't mine. Okay. No, uh, see, that kind of holds me liable. And I do, I do, you know, I will take credit, okay? It was my idea. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I called Boogie uh, right after I saw Jesse do this video where they were talking shit about me on his channel again. Pickle Boy's big secret. And it made me mad. So I called Boogie and I asked if he could invite Jesse over to his house with the idea being he's actually insane. That Boogie is completely insane. Mm -hmm. And he did it, and it worked. But the problem is, and I don't know if you want this on your video or not, because uh, I wanted to talk to you privately about it. You just started That's recording. That's fine. I'm an, I'm an open book. You know me, Michael. I don't care. That's fine. I think you might have went a little far. I don't think so. This is what you wanted. You said scared the shit out of him, dude. So I you, scared the shit out of him. He was scared. Bro, you physically assaulted him. Okay. All right, number one, if you pause the video and look at the bat I hit him with, it wasn't the Hello Kitty bat, okay? Uh, that was a foam bat. It was a poof bat, okay? It barely hurt him. It barely hurt him. It, then why I, was he like, crawling around on the ground like his legs were broke? I think psychosomatic shit. I don't know. I mean, but I mean, it, don't, it's got a plastic core to it. I've been hit with it for videos, and it hurts like a son of a bitch. Let but me it's not going to break question. anything. I need, like, straight up, you know, I want to talk... To, I, I don't know if you want me to use your real name, so I won't say your real name. I want to talk to you. Okay. okay. All right. Fine. Did you guys flip that shit? What do you mean flip? I don't know. Like sell a house? What are you talking about? Flip. No, shit. I mean like, okay, me and you came up with this good idea to prank Jesse. Right. Okay. And the first few videos were exactly what I wanted. I was like, oh, yeah, you're in love with him. You know, you're a super obsessed fan. We pre-planned you having this room in the house. Right. At some point, it changed from being, like, what I wanted to, like, being really extra weird. And part of me wonders is, did Jesse figure it out? And you guys no, are pranking No, what the hell? Dude, the dude poisoned me. He stole that, my car. He my... stole your car. He poisoned you. You assaulted him. You're lighting fireworks Because he's the fucking psycho kid. He's the psycho kid, Michael. Like, dude is legitimately crazy. He stole my car, left it double parked at the airport. They towed it. They impounded it. It was $400 to get it out of the damn Bentonville police station. Do you understand that? That's my money. That's real money. How, did I, how the hell did I flip this on you? 
Okay, I, and yeah, okay, maybe I, I did. wanted to make sure that you guys didn't figure it out and then you flipped it for videos because you're on Twitter talking about like, you know, oh, I'm watching Jesse work and like, what does that mean? Like, that, are you uh, what, 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 what am I gonna, what am I fucking, what, what am I supposed to tweet out, Michael? Am I supposed to tweet out, oh, hitting Jesse with a bat? Oh, I locked him in my head. I can't tweet that shit out, dude. I had to cover for us. I had to cover. Holy shit! Like, are you crazy? Like, Michael, I know you're fucking crazy, but are you fucking crazy? Like, dude, how did you not? So, it was so absurd that I had to wonder because it was. And it was the most insane thing I've ever seen in my whole what, entire life. What is it you take issue with? What is it you take issue with? Well, the first one was you hitting him with a baseball bat. Okay, I told you. That was a foam bat. I knew it wasn't going to do any real damage. Okay. Okay. Number two is on his part, poisoning you with medicine. I, you that, I'm still pissed off about that. He did not even Google. I saw the video. He didn't even Google to see what that medication was. He didn't know if that was going to make me piss. He didn't know if that was going to make... Because I, well, I piss medicine in the house. He didn't know if it was going to knock me out. He didn't know... He had literally no clue what that was going to do to me. Here's the problem that... The biggest problem that I take with the medicine is... If you would have died, would that have been my fault? Yes! Absolutely! This was your fucking idea, Michael! This was your fucking idea, Michael! You put me up to this. Okay, number one. Yes, I'm, I'm willing to admit it got a little out of control. What else do you have... What else do you have issues with? What did I do wrong? You're the fucking prankster, okay? You're the one pranking Bridget all the time. You were pranking your dad all the time. I've never done a prank in my life. This is my first time at bat. If you wanted it to be a specific way, you should have got specific. But when I Jesse know, got here, when Jesse got here, the very first thing Parker wanted to do was stay in a hotel. The very first fucking thing he said. He was bad talking to me before he even showed up, okay? And so I had to do something to keep him here, okay? Otherwise, I our prank wasn't going to work. I was making videos, too, calling him like a bitch for that. Like, oh, what are you doing, Parker? I was trying to keep him there just as he's, much as you. Because he's and a little fuck All of that boy. was good. I take no problem with any of that. That was fine. You did a good, good. job. There. There. That's what I wanted. Is that so tough to say? Is that <laughs> so tough to say? Dude, I'm telling you, it was good. It was hilarious. And if, and if it was not flipped and I'm not being pranked, then I'm sorry that you got fed medicine. That's not my fault. That how about the fact they the stole my fucking car? How, how do you think it was after five days of my wife not talking to me, after five days of her not even coming out of our bedroom, not letting me in there, by the way, when I needed a shirt, she threw one out in the fucking living room, okay? Five nights of sleeping in, in literally anywhere I could. I slept last night in the fucking shrine. Do you know what it's like to lay there and look at fucking Jesse's face after all this shit? Okay? The first time she talked to me is right after Jesse left. You know what she said? She didn't say, oh, hi, honey, I'm sorry. Let's see if we can patch things up. She said, where the fuck's my car? First time my wife had talked to me in five days, where's my fucking car? You know what I had to tell her? I don't know, because I, I fucking did not know where Jesse was. I didn't know if he was going to the airport. I, for all I knew, he was driving it back to fucking Jersey. That's on you. We didn't have a car for two days. That's on you. Don't say it's on me, dude. That's on you, dude. This dude. is your fucking idea. What else do you have issue with? Then What else do you have issue with? Okay. I did okay. I know a lot of people had an issue with the fuck doll. I didn't have a problem with that. I thought it was fun. That, that, that was, was very funny. funny. That was good. It and was, by the I'm way, telling you it was funny, dude. And people are always talking about how I waste stuff in my videos or whatever. By the way, that sex doll. I didn't buy that special. I just we already had that laying around. We just repurposed it. I taped his face to it. Put it to work. Don't give me that face, Michael. Don't I'm give me that face. Sure, his face wasn't already don't, on. I'm don't. Just like, Oh, my God. Okay, no, it wasn't. And don't sex shame me, Michael. We're into some kinky shit around here. That's fine. We're okay with that. Okay, don't sex shame me. We like what we like. I ain't, I ain't, I'm not getting up in your and Bridget's business. I don't know what you guys do, but it's we up to you. I'm not going to judge. <sighs> okay, but I thought that was funny. I thought that was funny. Did funny. you see his reaction? Come on. It was hilarious. All right, well, fine. That's fine. My <laughs> issues were with him giving you medicine and you hitting him with a bat. Those are the only problems I had, and the reason I had the problems, because this is my idea, and I don't want you to drop dead because of my idea, and I don't want you killing him over my idea. Well, I'm not going to kill anybody. Francis might kill somebody. <laughs> Francis might go on a fucking murder spree. Ah! I'm fucking with you, Michael. None of that's real. That's all make-believe. That's me acting. It's called acting. I am a thespian. <laughs> prank make-believe. Right, but that's the thing. If you want a prank expert... Hire a fucking prank expert. If you want me to just do what I do, that's, you know, I didn't know what I was doing. But I'm it was asking, funny. Was it was good. Make believe. Was yes or no? Was Jesse ever in on it? 
Jesse was never in on it. For all I okay. know, he's quaking in his boots right now, dude. For so, all so I know. So see all of this? <laughs> yep. No, don't laugh. Jesse. Yeah. No. no. Jesse, I'm sorry. I ain't. Got, my idea was to scare you, never attack you. I Like I said, Michael, he's the dude is a loose cannon. You dealt with him. You know what I'm fucking talking about. Dude, he was going through my computer. He was going through my notebooks. Right. I found new stuff. He went through my mail. He didn't record that. He went through your mail? mail thrown through my office, ripped open and read, and there was like highlighters, like highlighting stuff. He yeah, was that, going through stuff. Yeah, that's the thing, Juggies, and that's the thing. You see what Jesse wants you to see. He doesn't always have the camera on. He doesn't record everything, and not everything he does record makes it into the vlog. You don't know my side of shit, and you're never going to get to see it because he's never going to film that. He's never going to put that up. That's the thing. What you don't know is that from the moment that he was here, uh, Parker wanted the way. Parker was giving me shit off camera. He's talking about my house. He didn't wasn't good enough. He didn't like the room. He's talking about staying in a fucking hotel. You don't do that when you invited somebody's house. You don't ask for a fucking hotel. You don't know how Jesse was listening to Parker every single day and talking about, well, maybe we should get out of here. Maybe he is a little bit crazy. And that's where I did anything. That's where things even went off the rails. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I would get it's like... I noticed Parker was a bit of a problem too when he was here because at first, at first I was looking to Parker for a little bit of like sympathy, right. and I learned real quick I wasn't getting any of it because like he's behind the camera, <laughs> <laughs> laughing at me behind the camera and shit. Mm -hmm. Here's here's the other thing, Michael, and here's the thing: I love you very much, and I, I maybe I should say this for after the camera's not rolling. But the reality of it is, like, who are you to judge me about the way I do shit, dude? I see what you do to your fucking dad. I see what you do to your fucking girl. I know what Dude, you do, man. You're fucking I've crazy. I've never assaulted any of them, ever. Oh, bullshit. I've seen that shit. I've seen your videos. Some of your most famous videos. You're fucking taping shit to people. You're waking them up in the middle of the night. You're hitting them with shit. I've seen that shit. That's I've seen happened. your videos. Yes, you it does. Yes, yes it channel. does. What now about I fucking... You've stalking, never watched... Stalking fucking pranks and fucking zombie pranks and shit. I've seen this. You've, your dad is an old man. You could give him a fucking heart attack, dude. Let me tell you something. This stuff keeps Dad younger than he's ever been in his whole yeah. life. The worst for YouTube, he'd be dead by now. All I'm fucking saying is you are in no position to judge me, okay? That was my first time at bat. That was my first time at bat. What? I wanted my name clear from any wrongdoing because... If How is that possible? It's your idea! See, it was that's your what idea! About. That's what I mean, dude. Stop saying that. I don't want to be attached to this anymore. Okay, you are attached to it because it was your idea. And by the way, by the way, the other thing that you said to me before we started this, which you're conveniently leaving out, is by the way, and the juggies keep mentioning, why didn't Jesse call the cops? Why didn't Jesse call the cops? Why didn't Jesse call the cops? See, he doesn't want fucking me in trouble to begin with, but he also doesn't want to be in trouble because he literally poisoned me. He literally poisoned me. He literally committed a felony. And stole my fucking car over a prank. That's why I didn't call the fucking cops. You never got a chance to even tell him it was a prank. Because he fucking fled like a baby. I left him like 47, 87, I don't know fucking how many messages. Every one of them. Explain it to him. Explain it to him. But he doesn't, he doesn't know you were involved until today. So don't fucking judge me, Michael. I don't judge you at all, Boogie. This was your idea. I did it the best of my ability. Okay, you if you wanted if you wanted it done different, you should have left better instructions. That's all I can tell I you. I should have like I feel like maybe I should have been there because like if I was there, maybe I could have helped out because I feel like maybe you snapped them. I part maybe here's the it's, it's, it's acting. A, it's acting. I'm just playing. I'm saying, maybe it's a compliment to you. It was so realistic that I even I was like, okay, this is my prank, and I don't know if it's a prank. It was so a prank. That's it was a testament a prank. to you. It well, was thank you. Well, thank you. I will take that compliment. And we probably should end on a high note because I think you're getting agitated and I don't want to see a fucking Michael Rage. And I sure, sure shit don't want to have to do a Francis Rage on you. So let's get the fuck. Let's wrap this up for the kids. And then if you want, you, you got something to say off camera, you can say it, okay? Let's but talk off camera. All I all want is to not be attached to that prank anymore. So okay, but that's not possible because it was your idea. Right. The Emancipation Proclamation was fucking Lincoln's idea, so he fucking owns that shit. This is your idea. You fucking own it, Michael. You fucking own it, Michael. This is all oh, yours. Dude, I'm scared oh my God. it's attached to me. Well, I don't care. It, it doesn't matter. It's on camera now, Michael. It's on camera. I'm, I'm not going to actually get upset. Dude, you told me before we even started recording that you're still having like medical problems from this. That's on me. Yeah, if I had a fucking heart attack during this, Michael would have been on you. 
All right, guys. All right. Fuck it. Just fuck, Michael. Just calm down. Listen to me. Listen to me. This is on you. But just own it. Just own it. Just don't worry about it. I know it got a little out of control, but just fucking own it, Michael. Listen, guys, I'm Boogie 29 today. Thank you guys for watching. This kid behind the okay, camera. Take it that far. Yes, you did, Michael. This was your fucking no, idea. Fine. It was all me, Jesse. Every bit of it. Thank you. That's Thank you. Guys, thanks for watching. I love you very much. I'll speak with you again soon. You want to say goodbye? Thank you, guys. I'm really sorry, Jesse. I'm not sorry at all. <laughs> I ain't sorry at all. That shit was funny. <laughs>